Okay. Okay, this is my boy Nate. Um, he's been in the program for a while. And the basic problem is he does not like other cats. You know, we'll get into uh, fights with them. And it's not really a good situation for him here because I have four resident cats and always another foster. I'd love to see him in an environment where there are no other animals. Um, he's not a real cuddly cat, but he is a playful cat. Um, I'm able to um, pet him uh, quite a bit, actually. Uh, he lets me know when he's had enough. Um, oh, he, he's also a, um, a declaw. And a lot of times what happens is when uh, cats are declawed, that takes away their only uh, defense. And then they have to do the re resort to biting. So um, he's been known to bite, and you have to kind of keep a keep an eye on him. Um, see, he's also on a special diet. He had a really bad skin condition when he f was in the shelter. Um, but I'm convinced that that's completely related to what he's eating. He's currently on a a quality. Uh, cat food. It's not prescription. It's duck and green pea for canned food and he can, uh, for dry food, and he can eat probably anything for um, canned food. I, I feed the natural balance canned food also. Um, the test drive involves you saying that you will keep it for a month, and then at the end of three months, you'll decide whether or not you want to adopt him. It's a reduced adoption and actually the adoption fee has been covered because he's gotten a scholarship so there is no fee for adopting him. I would love to see him in an environment where there are no other cats. Um, I think he's going to be a, a, a very comfortable cat to have around after that happens. So I uh, would love to hear from you if you're uh, interested in trying him out. And he has to be within a one-day transport of Central Florida so that if you need to return him, I can get him back immediately. Um, and I hope you'll think about giving him a chance. I know that there are a lot of people out there that rescue cats, and usually it's not just one cat. And in this case, it would have to be just one cat. So I know we're looking for a very, very special adopter for Nate. And I hope to hear from person or persons uh, soon. Thanks for listening.